wetlands are a pretty simple place when you think about it. They're where water meets land, and sometimes they're a little wetter, sometimes they're a little drier. And they support an incredible diversity of life. This diversity of life provides the habitat for an enormous array of species. It's a place full of life, um, a place for water birds, for insects and invertebrates of all kinds, and for um, cleansing water that goes um, through into the groundwater. Uh, they can filter out uh, pollutants and siltation that might otherwise go into rivers and lakes and therefore keep the rivers and lakes better uh, conditioned for people and wildlife and fish as well. Well, you know, wetlands are important for a whole lot of things. And uh, one of the things that we share with landowners is how important wetlands are for times when we've got really high water, when we've got flooding events that are occurring around the state. Those wetland areas act like sponges and they really soak up the excess water. They can hold it there. They keep it off of other lands, you know, that are uh, kind of better used for other purposes. But a lot of the wetlands are better used for wetland purposes. In the past, we often thought of wetlands as wastelands. They're places to fill, places to drain. And over the course of our developing the country, we lost about half of our wetlands, both in the state and across the nation as a whole. In the past 40 years or so, we've realized the value of wetlands. We've passed laws to help protect them, and we've developed voluntary programs to work with landowners to restore wetland habitat on their own properties. We talk about wetland restoration and you know that brings up the question well you know what what was here well you know we talk about in the um, not so distant past you know even this this wetland area behind me was it was in agricultural production um, but even before that you know before a man was here or you know before this area was settled what was mainly here it was already a wetland and that's where we talk about we're restoring a wetland because that the wetland that was here in pre-settlement times, um, you know, likely w what we would have been looking at here is a forested floodplain wetland. And as settlers came into this area, that land was cleared of the trees. It was drained. Um, in many cases, you know, the drainage included, you know, not only ditches but active drainage like a tiling system or even a, a, a pump system to pump that water right out so that it could be farmed. And so, you know, what, what we're trying to do when we talk about wetland restoration is really try to uh, put back that hydrology that was there um, originally. Not necessarily, obviously, exactly like it was because we can't turn back time and make everything the way that it used to be, but really try to, you know, let the land function in, in a way that it had previously um, it, it, to provide some of those benefits that wetlands offer.